We're here at the Legends of the Ring convention with Paul Bearer. Paul, what's the haps? Oh, it's all you, brother. <laughs> Sirius XM, I got it on my computer, got it in my car. We love you guys. Now, uh, you've done a lot of dangerous things in wrestling. Uh, you're managing The Undertaker for Lord knows how long. Um, everybody has their stories of being injured. How bad was it for you to be buried in cement? Well, I don't know if we've got time to explain all that, mm -hmm. but uh, believe you me, I didn't get buried in cement all the way over my head. Thank I, goodness. I, I had to take it to about here, and they had a uh, stunt double. What? From Hollywood that came in, and he, t he took it the rest of the way, because that was a very dangerous, very dangerous stunt. Listen, I know dangerous for me. I know it was dangerous, but you're, you're uh, breaking a lot of hearts here. Your, your Nazi Santa Claus isn't real. You know, 15, 20 years ago, I wouldn't have told you that, but it's <laughs> 2011. We, uh, you know, I'm not going to insult anybody's intelligence. It's done the rest of us get with the times. Exactly. It's like the big fall I took off the, the balcony two or three months ago. Yeah. Pain, you know, you think that I fell all the way. I don't bounce that well. <laughs> now, it seems like every time there's a lull in uh, whatever's going on with The Undertaker or, or Kane, Paul Bearer is back on the scene. How much of the success of those guys do you think, especially early on, was Paul Bearer? No, I, 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 I'm very touchy about that situation. It, it's, you know, there ain't but one Undertaker. I one, no doubt about that. And Kane, and he's, he's definitely the, the phenom without a doubt. And nobody can, will ever do what he's done over the past 20 years and the record that he has. I'd like to, I'd like to think that I helped a lot, yeah. you know, but uh, it was a mutual, you know, it's like a marriage, you know. Are there moments like his WrestleMania matches and things like that where you think, God, I wish they would call me to go out there with him? No, not really. No? Uh, no, I like this WrestleMania. I was there. I, I worked the whole fan access thing at yeah. WrestleMania 27 in Atlanta. And during his match, I had was sitting in one of the boxes up top of the Georgia Dome, having a blast, enjoying the, enjoying the match just like everybody else. Do you feel guilty about putting the Ultimate Warrior in the casket? Oh, no. No, it was the money I put in my bank off that. It was great. You really are morbid. Thank you so much, Paul Bearer. Thank you. XM Series. We love you guys.